I trust you're not planning any trouble. What can I do for you, friend? I'm the leader of the Skal, but it's the Allmaker who truly protects and provides. As leader of the Skal, I name you friend to our people. You are welcome here. We are Nords, much like those you'll find in Skyrim. Long ago our path diverged from that of our cousins on the mainland. We live as one with the land, for the land provides all that we need. Also, like the Nords of old, we embrace the Allmaker. We do not worship the Nine Gods of the Empire. I was chosen by the people of the village when our last leader, Skaf the Giant, departed the cold world to join the Allmaker. I suppose I've always spoken my mind and tried to do what's best for the Skal. That's why the others call me Fanari Strong Voice. Until our next meeting, outsider. I can I do enjoy sharing stories of my travels in Tamriel with young Nicholas. Well, let me think. I suppose it's been nearly a year now. My goodness, how the time has flown. Well, not so far. They think I'm a bit strange, but they seem to tolerate me. In fact, they've been very accommodating, hospitable even. They seem happy to talk about their traditions and history. Oh, no, most certainly not. I'm a historian. I'm here to learn about the history of Soul's time. Soul's time is a fascinating place, but we know so little about its past. There are many mysteries that remain unsolved. Yes, that was a most disturbing experience. But to answer your question, the architecture was strange, almost otherworldly. Given that, and the considerable power it must have taken to affect our minds so completely, it would suggest the work of a powerful mage. Either that, or perhaps a Daedra. If so, then may the Nine protect us. Powerful and malevolent entities who make their home on the plane of oblivion. Some of the more powerful among them can exert their influence within our world. And when they do, men inevitably suffer. Mm-hmm. 